Good day, everybody. My name is Mike uh, with Hurricane Express. Today, we're going to do a short informational video on how to override our Peterbilt 579's five minute idle shutoff. Uh, give you a little background. Uh, the reason why we have the five minute idle shutoff is for to conserve fuel. Uh, the truck generally uses about a gallon an hour uh, at idle. Um, we've equipped our 579's with uh, Thermal King Evolution tri-packs. Uh, those usually burn about a gallon of fuel every eight hours. So uh, it's in everyone's best interest to let the tri-pack do its job, keep the truck cool while the truck is not running. Uh, in hot temperatures though, that tri-pack struggles to maintain you know, comfortable temperatures in the truck. Uh, so we recommend idling the truck over 95 degrees. Uh, this video is to show you how to make that truck idle uh, and bypass that five minute idle shutoff. So fairly simple process. Uh, once the uh, couple requirements have been met, one of them is both brakes have to be set. Uh, the temperature gauge on the dash must exceed 95 degrees. Uh, once five minutes of time elapses, there will be an indicator and uh, light on the dash uh, come on telling you that the truck's going to shut off uh, and give you a countdown. Uh, it's also going to give you an audible alarm. During this audible alarm and countdown, all you've got to do is to press the clutch to the floor and hold it there until the audible alarm and the indicator light go away. Once you've done that, the truck will continue to idle uh, until you shut it off. So. That's the process. Um, so from there, I, you know, I wish you a good day. Be safe out there, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Have a great day.